Welcome back to Soda City Live. For the first time since the pandemic, the Columbia chapter of the Jack and Jill of America will be hosting one of their signature fundraising events. It's Stilettos and Bows. Joining us to share more about the signature fundraising event and Jack and Jill of America efforts are chapter president Fern Kelly and fundraising co-chair Sharon Earl. Ladies, thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you for having us. It's such a pleasure. I hear so much about Jack and Jill of America <laughs> and I've never taken the time to see what is Jack and Jill of America. So Fern, I'm going to have you for those of like myself that are very unfamiliar with Jack and Jill of America. Can you tell us what it is that you all do? Yes. So Jack and Jill of America Incorporated is a nonprofit membership organization. It consists of mothers with children who have or ages 2 to 19, and the focus is on strengthening African American future leaders by way of leadership development, civic duty, philanthropic uh, giving, and community service. Beautiful. And talk about some of the events that you have. This is your signature event. So what right. types of events do you have throughout the year? Well, because of our focus on strengthening children, we want to always promote activities and, and opportunities for children to learn culturally, socially, health, all of those things. And so as an organization, a nonprofit organization, we are always focused on partnering with organizations like March of Dimes, the James R. Clark Six Cell Anemia Foundation, all of those things that will allow us the opportunity to give back to our community. And the Columbia chapter specifically was chartered in 1951, so we've been in existence wow. for a very long time. Wow. And we've been very tied closely to the community. That is awesome. So awesome job there. Mm -hmm. And Sharon, I'm going to ask you, mm -hmm. tell us about this fundraiser in particular. Okay, so Stilettos and Bows started um, 2013. And typically the event uh, is held the Friday before Thanksgiving. So it's sort of a kickoff to yeah. the holiday season, you know, for the Columbia community. So this year's event will be held at uh, the Gala Event Center uh, from 8 o'clock until midnight. And it's going to be super fun. We have the Mike Stone Band performing. Um, it's, it's just going to be an evening of fellowship and really to, for the community to get out and kick off the holiday season with us. So Listen, we're super excited. I saw some of the pictures and I was like, every picture that I got <laughs> looked like they were having a good time. <laughs> if there's going to be a way you sell me a fun fundraiser event, it's going to be through pictures like these. The pictures are going to be coming up, but it looks like the ladies and gentlemen are like, I don't know if you were doing a line dance or what, but I said, oh, this, this right here, this is where I want to be. This is the type of event that I want to be at. Um, is there are there any auctions or anything that'll take place at this particular event? No, they're not. There won't be an auction, mm -hmm. you know, this time. Um, in the past, we have done that. Mm -hmm. Again, this is our first year back right. since the pandemic. So we're kind of easing our way into a good time. Um, but it'll, it'll be tons of fun uh, and, and lots of things to do. Awesome. Tell me about the, the dress code. Is cocktail, it just casual cocktail? holiday okay. cocktail? Mm -hmm. You know, definitely your dancing shoes. Uh, listen, or, yeah, or backup shoes. I'm one of those people. I have some heels on. I think I'm cute, and then five seconds later, I'm like, let me go ahead and swap them out. They've seen me. Yeah, yeah. I'm flat shoes yes. on. Um, let's talk about the proceeds from this event yes. in particular. Tell me where those proceeds are going. Yes. So proceeds will go to the Jack and Jill of America Foundation, which is our national philanthropic arm of Jack and Jill of America that focuses again nationally on part partnering with organizations that are geared towards helping our communities and our children. And then locally, the proceeds will benefit In the Middle, which is an organization that supports and educates families dealing with breast cancer uh, situations. And 100% of those proceeds that are given to those uh, members in the In the Middle program benefit directly to the families. And then the other organization is SC Uplift Community Outreach, which is an organization that helps with housing affordability for individuals and seniors. Awesome. And I have two questions before we wrap things up here. One, how can the community support uh, the Columbia chapter of Jack and Jill of America? And what does someone need to become a, a member or to get involved? Okay. Well, to support the fundraiser in particular, <laughs> uh, you can go, if you know a member of the chapter, that's certainly a way to obtain a ticket and also visiting our Facebook page, Columbia Jack and Jill. And then as far as membership, we do invite members into the uh, organization by way of sponsorship and information can be found on our website as well or the home, the Facebook page. Perfect. So this event is going to be taking place at the Gala Event Center the 16th? 17th. 17th. Mm -hmm. And 
the, again, they can get their tickets on you guys' Facebook page okay. or through a member. Member of the chapter, yes. Perfect. And how much are the tickets? $100. They're $100. Awesome. Well, ladies, thank you so much for joining us and sharing these details thank about you. this event. I want to go and kick my shoes off, Yes, too. come on. <laughs> yes, please. Right. You're invited. <laughs> Absolutely. And ladies, again, thank you. We'll have these details on our website, SodaCityLive.com. Be sure to stick with us. We have much more coming up after this.